One of my sons told me that uh, in talking with other members of the 352nd family, uh, he's learned more about me than he ever learned from me in all the years we knew each other. I don't consider myself great, and I certainly was no hero. I just was over there doing the job that uh, I was assigned as best I could do it. It was, it was just something that I'm going to remember the rest of my life. I'm the oldest. I'm seven minutes older than Buck. Yeah, but I outrank him. <laughs> well, sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> We'd die for each other. I don't know a better way to describe it. We were family. When they need you, you're there. His life depended on you, and your life depended on him. And I think when you go through a thing like that for months on end, when you come back for the rest of your life, you're always going to be friends. You trusted each other so much, there is certainly a bond that develops, a bond of trust, a bond of friendship, a bond of loyalty. Uh, we just, uh, we became brothers in the air. Heroes of the 352nd Fighter Group, welcome. Welcome to the Virginia Air National Guard. The 352nd established the enviable record which Fighter Command General William Kepner described as second to none. The 352nd flew 420 combat missions, 115,673 sorties, 59,387 combat hours, and destroyed 776 enemy aircraft between September of 43 and April of 45. The group had 28 aces and was awarded the Distinguished Unit Citation and French Croix de Guerre with Palm. These are impressive statistics, but no statistic can measure the human sacrifice. Some people watch history unfold, but the 352nd Fighter Group made history. You defended the Republic against all enemies, and you held firm the fabric of our nation when times were tough, desperate, and deadly. You faced the evils of war, and you answered the call to secure our freedom and to defend our sacred liberties. The Virginia Air National Guard joins all of America today in paying tribute to you for all that you have done for our country. Your selfless service to this nation made a difference for America and the world. You made the United States a preeminent force in the world today. May God bless you and keep you in his loving arms. And we will never, never forget what you did.